Oh my gosh. They're so good. I know. I'm like, I wish I could do that. <laughs> you were just enjoying a performance by the amazing McTaggart Irish dancers. They're going to be performing in this weekend's St. Patrick's Day Parade through downtown Lexington. Yeah, Allison Duvall joins us with more about the studio and what you can expect to see if you head downtown on Saturday. They Thanks for coming amazing. in. Really Thank good. you. Yeah. We're really proud yeah. of them. They should be. Yeah. 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 They did great. So most of these dancers, I mean, do they start? I mean, they're very young still. I mean, how still young will you take dancers? I mean, at what age? We usually start them around five years old, but okay. we have some really precocious three and four-year-olds who come <laughs> to us. And then our oldest dancers are in their 70s and 80s. Really? Yeah, we take dancers from like really oh, young yeah. ones all the way up through adult. Oh, yeah. my God. Yeah. They, they must have been training for a while to be that precise. So they don't yeah. have any schooling, I assume. This is all they do. Eat, sleep, yeah. and breathe. Eat, dance. sleep, and breathe, right? Yeah. They, they'd mm -hmm. all move into our studio, I think, if they could. Yeah. <laughs> the dancers, they don't know how to read, any of them. But they're fantastic, <laughs> they're fantastic when it fantastic comes dancers. to dancing. Yeah. Oh, they are yeah. amazing. What kind of preparation goes into, I, I know they practice regularly, but yeah. a special event like the huge St. Patrick's Day Parade this weekend. Sure. So we actually start rehearsing for St. Patrick's Day in December. Really? And then for Irish dancers, it's a whole season. It's not yeah. just a day. Yeah. So so we have rehearsals with these guys two or three times a week mm -hmm. from December all the way up through this weekend. And then we've got a recital next weekend. So our St. Patrick's Day continues through the end of March. Yeah. So yeah. can people come out and watch the recital? Oh, we'd love that. Absolutely. Yeah. If you check out our website, our recital is March 24th, okay. which is Saturday. And our website is kyirishdancers.org. So please come check it out. But we'll be at the parade on Saturday as well. And then we perform in the festival tent at okay. 1130. What's okay. the strategy for the parade? Are they going to dance all the way through the parade route? <laughs> they do, <laughs> yeah. Steps. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they are. They're going to be extending their legs down the street. Yeah. So um, Irish dancers are athletes as much as they are artists. Yeah. And so our students practice for months and months. And we'll be starting at the Midland Avenue, you know, start by the Herald Leader Building, dancing all the way down mm -hmm. Main Street. So mm -hmm. they get a great workout. They probably get like 10,000, 20,000 steps on a step counter imagine, just yeah. in the parade. Yeah. yeah. Goodness. Yeah. yeah it's got to be a great exercise. It Gosh. really is. Yeah. They are amazing. Love the outfits, oh too. The outfits are fantastic yes. as well. You guys look great. Look at it. Give us a wave, guys. Great job. My you are goodness. amazing. If you want to check them out in the 39th Annual All Tech St. Patrick's Day Parade this Saturday, March 17th at 1 p.m. in downtown Lexington. For more information, log on to their website at she said kyirishdancers.org. You guys want to dance a little more for us? Uh, take us a break. Okay, here they are, McTaggart Irish Dancers. Take it away, guys.